Hello, hello everybody. everybody. Bunny. <laughs> your, your hello is making the baby cry. <laughs> Just kidding. Woke him up for sure. Hopefully it woke you up too because you have arrived. This is the station <laughs> for the nation. This is the Free Fam Cam channel and guess what we're doing today? <laughs> we are revealing Louise's new nursery. room is for our new little baby shark who's just come home and we have put together a beautiful room thanks to Starker. If you guys want to see more about the actual details of how to assemble it, what comes with it, what you can buy etc, go check out the other video and you'll be able to see all those details. This is just going to give you the look of the room where Jacques is sleeping. <laughs> cool. Okay, Louise, so show us around. Okay. So I went with a very neutral colour scheme for the room. Um, I just wanted to emphasize the beautiful French accents in this room and the crib and drawers are just so beautiful that I didn't really want to detract from them. So we stuck with whites, beiges and hues of grey and with the odd accent of blue. So now we've moved over to the beautiful stocky changer and I want to show you what I've got in the drawers. Since this is my fifth child, I decided to streamline things a little bit and really only get what we needed. So I'll show you what I've thought is necessary for us and you can have a look at some of the cool products. Okay, starting out on top we have little baby Jacques, a very necessary component of this entire nursery. But I was given this cute little caddy, which I think is so beautiful because it goes with our stunning French style. And inside I've decided to put all his little mementos, like his hospital bracelets. Look how small those are. That's two. And a letter that Gabby wrote us in the hospital. Some cards and some extra special things. Every child I've had, I have, I'm sure, or most moms do, have like a big box for each child. It gets bigger and bigger as they get older. With all their things and their artwork and their little memories, starting right from the hospital bracelets. So, we're off to a good start. Okay, so I have um, this drawer set, which only exclusively has Jacques items in it. And this is how I've packed it. Come and have a look. Okay. So on the top we have a little space for the little miniature diapers and they fit perfectly in there. I am a huge fan of Pact because this company is all good. The way they manufacture their products is in an all good way. I even kept this label on here because I wanted to show you guys. I'm sorry, I just, I just love them. No sweatshops, no child labor, no toxic pesticides and no GMO cotton. Fair trade, they pay all their staff, fair wages, and what's more than that is that I've used a lot of these products on JP, his little vests and little leggings. And what I am always shocked about is no matter how many times I wash them, they come out looking new. So this is basically the top drawer is more like the underwear, undergarments area. So I also have these cute little leggings. They come packaged like this. I haven't washed these ones yet, but they are just so cute. And especially here in Europe, when it's cold, it's nice to put this on under the baby suits. But when it gets warmer, like today's a nice spring day, JP, JP, I've got to remember this baby name. It's Jacques, it's Jacques, sorry. This, <laughs> when it's a nice warm spring day like today, then Jacques can wear this just as an outfit. This is also from Pat. Look how sweet. Little baby vest, leggings, and their soft little socks. Mm -hmm. 
another great company that I've also kept in here. So as I'm about to run out the door, it's super easy just to grab, is the Milk Snob Covers. So I'm sure many of you have seen these products and for those of you that don't know how they worked, in fact, for me with Jacques, it's my first time ever using any type of cover like this. I don't know why it's taken people so long to think of this fantastic idea. So basically, it's a breastfeeding cover. Okay. So you can wear it like this. I'm just going to show you quick. Like this. And then you can obviously breastfeed your baby discreetly, which is really nice. So you can wear it as a scarf. And then basically what else you can also do is you can also use it in your little first car seat. You know, the one that you carry to cover the baby from germs, air, etc. Sun. And then also, lastly, you can use it in the shopping cart. Now I know that in Italy I'm going to get asked by so many people about this item because I have never seen one here before. And they do a variety of beautiful colors as well. So I have this gray and cream stripe one, which I like. It's kind of neutral, goes with most outfits. This really awesome light blue and cream pattern. And another really lovely item that this company does and that I was a massive fan of for JP was the Muslim wraps, the swaddles. I'm gonna actually wrap up shark now. Oh super soft cotton look at this and I use these so much because I didn't actually know about the covers so I even use this as a breastfeeding cover you can also put this over the stroller but look how super chic and super cool the babies look wrapped up in this look at this little bean look how cute he looks they love it they just love being wrapped up like this look how calm he is and I love the patterns, the super cute polka dots. I love that like the biggest drawer is all just shoes. So these are all little knitted booties, some packed socks. Look how cute these ones are. I love these ones. Organic, super soft and made in a wind powered factory. Very nice. And then we also have our lovely little Pierre paid shoes, but these are just still a little big, I think, for this baby. Look how cute those are. So you can see Claude and I love shoes. Look at the Converse socks. And these are the most awesome moccasins. Made from genuine leather. So soft. Freshly put. Beautiful. And their packaging is so nice. Okay, and the last but not least is just at the moment Jacques' day-to-day -day wear, which is pretty much a lot of baby suits and jumpers with some cute little knitted pants. So basically that drawer is like my rotating drawer. At the moment I have one to three months and then I'll shift out for the next size, like three to six and just keep moving the baby clothes. And what I normally do is pack it straight into a box, only the items I want and then the rest of the items we just donate to charity. What I love about this crib, my favorite part, is this canopy roof. What we've also started doing at night is we have like one of those little projection things that plays music for babies and it projects on the roof of this. It is just so cute. It's like the baby's own cinema. So this is a full size crib so it will be suitable for a toddler but this also becomes a bed. A full size bed. So as you continue to watch us and see JP and Jacques grow you will see how we transform this bed. Pretty awesome.
our nursery as much as we do. It feels like home. <laughs> and baby is waking. So yeah, you know what that like, means? Oh hell, we've got to cut this. The duty <laughs> begins. <laughs> Feed, change diaper, put to sleep. <laughs> I'm watching TV. <laughs> Hang on, friends, I've got to tell you something. Guys, thank you for watching. Thank you to Stocker for this beautiful home nursery set, the dresser and the beautiful crib that grows with your child. Thank you to Milk Snob for their beautiful wraps and, and covers. covers. And thank you to Pact for all their wonderful socks and their clothes that they have supplied Jacques and JP with. <laughs> He's busy stroking his brother. Yes! Guys, thanks for watching. We love you lots. Remember to give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Take care. Bye. Bye.